Africa for you once again live in Lagos talking to Nigerian artists, role models making a difference to the Nigerian scene here in Lagos and also to different parts of Africa and today we're speaking to gospel artists, upcoming gospel artists, uh, profound gospel artists Sam Obibwe here in Lagos telling us about his projects, initiatives and the music scene in Nigeria. Sam, welcome to Africa for you radio show. How are you today? I'm good. <laughs> it's fun to be on the show. And Sam Ebube, I'm born and brought up in Lagos, Nigeria. I do gospel music and music that is well delivered through the help of the Holy Spirit. And my aim and objective is to bring gospel music back to its rightful place. And that's what I believe how far and God has been so faithful. So tell me, how did you get into music? Yeah, music. I started music when I was young from childhood in the church and, um, you know, after school and every other stuff, I got a good job, you know, um, working fine. God's giving assignment came in, which I just have to fulfill. That's why I'm doing the gospel. Looking back down the music scene, what would you say are your most memorable achievements in the music scene in Nigeria today? Wow, the first one that is that is memorable is the MTV based top ten, you know, and it, it, it's it's a it's a it's a big thing that has happened that has happened to gospel industry, you know, seeing gospel music video being played on MTV based and trace and brand new videos, you know, it, it's one of the major one of the major one that are, is so memorable that even even if I if I if I don't want to say it even on, on everywhere on this platform always keep asking Sam it will be man we are glad to see you on this platform MTV you know, it's one of the good things making sure that our gospel music reach the whole world. That's fantastic. Now the music scene in Nigeria today seems to have developed and grown very largely, not just in Nigeria, but in different parts of um, Africa also, and different parts of the world. What do you think about the Nigerian music scene today? Well, we are moving forward. We keep moving every day, and um, we, 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 I still look forward to for our music all over the world. Like last week, I, I got a, a radio interview in US, and, and the lady was like, since the time she has played a song, Think of You, and Kabiosi, almost everyone just keep, it's, those are, those, those is, as in those are the platforms that we believe and we expect gospel music to be. And we thank God we are there already. As an artist, as a Nigerian artist, I've been speaking to lots of Nigerian artists this week and last week about the music scene in Nigeria also, but also about the role of a Nigerian artist today. What role do you think a Nigerian artist has today in passing on setting a good example for the future of tomorrow's generation? Yeah, we are, we are Christ-like. And whatsoever thing we do, we, we should always live our life like as, as an example to others. Everybody's looking up to Sammy Gobe, everybody's looking up to, to one of that gospel artists or the other, Lara George and every other and Midnight Friend, every other one. Everyone is looking up to us. Our own um, job is to make sure that we live Christ like in all things we do. What projects have you got lined up for this year? the music scene, either in Nigeria or different parts of the world, TV projects, radio projects, music projects, tours, what's lined up? What can our listeners expect? Yeah, they should expect Sam will be in UK very soon, very, very soon. By June, I should, uh, I'll be in US and Italy. I've got so many nominations for awards that we're going to pick back home. And to my fans all over the world, expect me very soon in your country. Who would you say are your main inspirations, both on the music scene and generally and morally? Yeah, Holy Spirit has actually been my has been my inspiration for life, and in the gospel um, industry, and Donnie McClurkey and Sister Winners, I, I love their job and a lot of them like that. For as much as you produce good music, I'm a lover of all good music. We're gonna play some of your tracks very shortly. Can you tell us about these tracks, how they came about and what they're all about? Yeah, Kabiosi in the track, uh, it's, it, it's, a, it's a Nigerian and African blend with a spice of uh, um, this um, uh, dancing stuff in church. That's what I have in Kabiosi, so featuring Midnight Crew, Sam Ibobe. And the, the second one, Think of You. I'm very, very sure when you listen to this song, you will like, wow, are you sure this is coming from Nigeria? Wouldn't you be blessed with this song? Think of you. All made in Nigeria, set the pace for tomorrow, Africa and the world. Also, if people want to learn more about you, especially my listening audience here in Reading, London and different parts of the world, are there any social media platforms, websites where people can reach you to learn more about you or follow your projects? 
Yeah, they can follow me up on Facebook, on Twitter, Sam Abel Bay. You can, you can as well follow me on Reverb Nation and and um, YouTube as well to, to watch these videos that, that we've been talking about. Thank of you. Keep me posted of all the great work you're doing in the community. When I'm back in Lagos, I will catch up with you. And I'm sure when you're in the UK, you'll come on my show for another live studio. Thanks for coming in. Oh, you're welcome. It's more than a pleasure being on your show. And I'll be touching base. I'll be touching this program live very soon.